Welcome back. In this video, we're going to continue to talk about how to implement the sales funnel. And in particular, you've been looking at the diagram. We've been talking about upsells. We do want to talk about what upsells are and why they're important to this process. Now, after the front end purchase, your buyer will see another offer. And that's going to be your first upsell. And actually, they're going to see two other upsells right after that. So what does that mean? Well, if you think about it, if you've ever purchased a domain name at GoDaddy, and if you haven't, it's almost worth going to purchase one in order to see this process. GoDaddy will give you several opportunities to make several purchases, and they give you these opportunities so that you can enhance uh, what you're already buying. It, they probably don't make a lot of money on domain names uh, altogether, but they probably make a lot more of their profit on the sale of other products and services. And so they give you several offers throughout the checkout process before you actually get to actually pay. And that's basically what you're doing, doing the same thing that GoDaddy does. Domino's Pizza does the same thing. And they give you several opportunities to uh, order more and to add more to your pizza and to add other, uh, you know, uh, other things to the pizza, adding drinks. And they give you the opportunities again to spend more money and to actually generate more profit for uh, Domino's. And you'll actually see this with Best Buy after you've purchased something and uh, they will give you the opportunity to get accessories. They also give you the opportunity to get, uh, to get a plan, right, to protect your, you know, to protect the repairs. All kinds of companies, large and small, will provide their buyers with upsell opportunities and you want to do the very same thing a digital product in that respect is no different than a physical product so <clears throat> you're gonna see this from the uh, from the sales funnels of seven to eight figure marketers this is the way that you multiply your profits and in fact we talked about customer lifetime value but this can almost skyrocket your, skyrocket your customer lifetime value by, in some cases, over a 1,000 to 1,400%. It's very easy to do that if a customer makes a front-end purchase and buys all the upsells that you give them. So what you want to do, and what we have been talking about in this course, is you're building a three-level upsell. Now, you don't want to do more than that. Now, this will irritate your customer and it will keep them and prevent them from wanting to go into another buying relationship with you again, even as they are on your email list. So three is the limit. In some cases, you may want to consider, based on the niche, even doing less than that. Now, overall, this is going to increase your conversion rates. It, it really is the key. This model or adding in an upsell, giving them the opportunity once they make your front-end purchase to, 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 to buy more is the key to exponential profit. Um, you have the buyer right there. And this is why even if you don't have a lot of traffic, you are exercising the maximum opportunity for the buyer while they're there. So uh, you have one buyer that might make four purchases. And if you think about it, if you were to use paid advertising to try to acquire four new customers to make one front end sale, that's going to cost you. Well, this doesn't cost you anything because the buyer is already there. The, the, whatever you paid or whatever uh, that whatever the, that buyer actually cost you, if you actually attracted them through paid traffic, that is the cost that you'll be paying. But you will be seeing a high ROI because they will be buying Four, three to four products from that one appearance or that one visit to your site. And probably the key in this, and we're going to be talking about this in the, in the rest of the course, this is very easy to set up in JVZoo, very easy. And you will be able to set up your upsells with astonishing ease. Um, all you'll need to do is to make sure your copy is right and that you have it on the right web page, but setting up your upsells it's going to be very easy, and you're going to be able to do that um, with <clears throat> with JVZoo. So that is the, the 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 benefit of doing upsells inside of your product funnel. It is the key to being able to maximize 
what it is that you're doing with your visitors when they come to your site. Now, in the next video, uh, we're going to talk about a related subject, specifically with this model. We're going to be talking about downsells and traditional downsells and downsells in how you are going to execute them. Okay, so with that, thanks, and I will see you in the next video.